A non-commissioned officer, called a sub-officer in some countries, is a military officer who has not been given a commission. Non-commissioned officers, in the English-speaking world, usually obtain their position of authority by promotion through the enlisted ranks. The NCO Corps usually includes all grades of corporal and sergeant. In some countries, warrant officers also carry out the duties of NCOs. The naval equivalent includes some or all grades of petty officer, although not all navies class their petty officers as NCOs. There are different classes of non-commissioned officer, including junior non-commissioned officers and senior non-commissioned officers. Function The non-commissioned officer corps is often referred to as the backbone of the armed services, as they are the primary and most visible leaders for most military personnel. Additionally, they are the leaders primarily responsible for executing a military organization's mission and for training military personnel so they are prepared to execute their missions. NCO training and education typically includes leadership and management as well as service-specific and combat training. Senior NCOs are considered the primary link between enlisted personnel and the commissioned officers in a military organization. Their advice and guidance is particularly important for junior officers, who begin their careers in a position of authority but generally lack practical experience. National Usage Australia In the Australian Army, the NCOs perform most of the physical duties and management. Lance corporals and corporals are called junior NCOs, while sergeants, staff sergeants, warrant officers class 2 and 1 are classified as senior NCOs. Officers in the Australian Army perform paperwork duties whilst in a barracks environment while the NCOs ensure discipline is being maintained. In battle, it is the senior NCOs that ensure the soldiers are doing their job, while the officers are looking at the wider tactical picture. In the New South Wales Police Force, NCOs perform supervisory and coordination roles. The ranks of probationary constable through to leading senior constable are referred to as constables. All NCOs within the NSW police are given a warrant of appointment under the Commissioner's hand and seal. All officers within the Australian Defence Force cadets are non-commissioned. ADFC officers are appointed by the Director General of their respective branch. Canada, in the Canadian Forces, the Queen's regulations and orders formally defined a non-commissioned officer as a Canadian Forces member holding the rank of sergeant or corporal. In the 1990s, the term non-commissioned member was introduced to indicate all ranks in the Canadian forces from recruit to chief warrant officer. By definition, with the unification of the CF into one service, the rank of sergeant included the naval rank of petty officer second class, and corporal includes the naval rank of leading seaman. Corporal also includes the appointment of master corporal. NCOs are officially divided into two categories, junior non-commissioned officers consisting of corporals leading seamen and master corporals master seamen, and senior non-commissioned members, consisting of sergeants and petty officers second class. In the Royal Canadian Navy, however, the accepted definition of NCO reflects the international use of the term. Junior non-commissioned officers mess and billet with privates and seamen. Their mess is usually referred to as the junior ranks mess. Conversely, Senior non-commissioned officers mess and billet with warrant officers. Their mess is normally referred to as the warrant officers and sergeants mess or the chiefs and petty officers mess. As a group, NCOs rank above privates and below warrant officers. The term non-commissioned members includes these ranks. Finland, in the Finnish Defence Force, NCOs includes all ranks from corporal to sergeant major. Ranks of Lance Corporal and Leading Seaman are considered not to be NCO ranks. This ruling applies to all branches of service and also to the troops of the Border Guard. Sweden, in 1983 the NCO Corps, since 1972 called the Platoon Officer Corps, was disbanded and its members were given commissions as officers in ranks of second or first lieutenant in Sweden's new one-tier military leadership system. In 2009 a similar system as the NCO Corps was re-established, called Specialist Officers. Direct recruitment from civilian life is followed by basic and preparatory leadership training, and advanced leadership training during 1.5 years as a specialist cadet at the Military Academy in Halmstad, 
a warrant as an O06, followed by specialist technical training. Swedish specialist officers have relative ranks that matches the commissioned officers. An O07 takes precedent over a second lieutenant, for instance. France, in France and French-speaking countries like Belgium and most former French colonies, the term sous-officier is a class of ranks between the rank and file and commissioned officers. Corporals belong to the rank and file. Sous-officiers include two subclasses, subalterns, and super-copyright rears. Sous-officiers super-copyright rears can perform various functions within a regiment or battalion, including commanding a platoon or section. Germany, in Germany in German-speaking countries like Austria, the term Unteroffizier describes a class of ranks between normal enlisted personnel and officers. In this group of ranks there are, in Germany, two other classes, Unteroffizier mit Portipi and Unteroffizier und Portipi, both containing several ranks, which in Austria would be Unteroffizier and Har Paragraph here Unteroffizier. New Zealand, in the New Zealand Defence Force, a non-commissioned officer is defined as, a, in relation to the Navy a rating of warrant officer, chief petty officer, petty officer, or leading rank. And include these a Euro, I, a non-commissioned officer of the Army or the Air Force attached to the Navy. And, E, a person duly attached or lent as a non-commissioned officer to or seconded for service or appointed for duty as a non-commissioned officer with the Navy. B, in relation to the Army, a soldier above the rank of private but below the rank of officer cadet and includes a warrant officer, and also includes a Euro, I, a non-commissioned officer of the Navy or the Air Force attached to the Army, and, E, a person duly attached or lent as a non-commissioned officer to or seconded for service or appointed for duty as a non-commissioned officer with the Army. C, in relation to the Air Force, an airman above the rank of leading aircraftman but below the rank of officer cadet, and includes a warrant officer and also includes a Euro, I, a non-commissioned officer of the Navy or the Army attached to the Air Force, and, E, a person duly attached or lent as a non-commissioned officer to or seconded for service or appointed for duty as a non-commissioned officer with the Air Force, a Euro Defense Act 1990, Sec 2. Singapore, in the Singapore Armed Forces, the term non-commissioned officer is no longer officially used, being replaced with specialist. The term NCO however is still frequently used unofficially among the Army. United Kingdom In the British Armed Forces, NCOs are divided into two categories. Lance Corporals and Corporals are junior NCOs. Sergeants, Staff Sergeants, and RAF Chief Technicians and Flight Sergeants are senior NCOs. Warrant officers are often included in the senior NCO category, but actually form a separate class of their own, similar in many ways to NCOs but with a royal warrant. Senior NCOs and WOs have their own messes, which are similar to officers' messes, whereas junior NCOs live and eat with the unranked personnel. The Royal Navy does not refer to its petty officers and chief petty officers as NCOs, but calls them senior ratings. Leading ratings and below are junior ratings. United States in the United States Army, United States Air Force, and United States Marine Corps, all ranks of sergeant are termed NCOs, as are corporals in the Army and Marine Corps. A Marine Corps Lance Corporal is not considered an NCO as of 1991. Prior to that year they were listed as junior NCOs in the NCO Handbook. The rank of corporal in the Army is a junior NCO, and is to be shown the same respect as any other NCO. In the United States Air Force, E5 and E6 are classified under the NCO tier, while E7, E8, and E9 are considered senior non-commissioned officers. In the United States Navy and United States Coast Guard, all ranks of petty officer are so designated. Junior NCOs, or simply NCOs in USMC usage, function as first-tier supervisors and technical leaders. NCOs serving in the top three enlisted grades are termed senior non-commissioned officers. Senior NCOs are expected to exercise leadership at a more general level. They lead larger groups of service members, mentor junior officers, 
and advise senior officers on matters pertaining to their areas of responsibility. A select few senior NCOs in pay grade E9 serve as senior enlisted advisors to senior commanders in each service and in duty unified commands, for example, United States Strategic Command, United States European Command, United States Pacific Command, etc., and duty agencies, for example the Defense Information Systems Agency, Defense Intelligence Agency and the National Security Agency. One senior E9, selected by the service chief of staff, is the ranking NCOPO in that service, holds the highest enlisted rank for that service, and is responsible for advising their service secretary and chief of staff. One E9 holds a similar position as the SEA to the chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff. Senior enlisted advisors, service enlisted advisors and the SEA to the chairman advise senior officer and civilian leaders on all issues affecting operational missions and the readiness, utilization, morale, technical and professional development, and quality of life of the enlisted force. Within the United States Marine Corps, senior NCOs are referred to as staff non-commissioned officers and also include the rank of staff sergeant. SNCOs are those career Marines serving in grades E6 through E9. The ranks include Staff Sergeant, Gunnery Sergeant, Master Sergeant slash First Sergeant, and Master Gunnery Sergeant slash Sergeant Major. The title of Superintendent is used by the United States Air Force as the title of the non-commissioned officer in charge of a section, flight, staff agency, directorate, or similar organization. These positions are assigned to senior non-commissioned officers, as opposed to the titles NCOIC and Chief or Director. Warrant officers in the United States Armed Forces are considered specialty officers and fall between non-commissioned and commissioned officers. U.S. Warrant officers also have their own rank tier and pay grade. However, when U.S. Warrant officers achieve the rank of Chief Warrant Officer or higher, they are commissioned and are considered commissioned U.S. officers just like any other commissioned officer, but are still held in a different pay grade tier. NCO candidate course, beginning in 1967 at Fort Benning, Georgia, the U.S. Army non-commissioned officer candidate course was a Vietnam War era program developed to alleviate shortages of enlisted leaders at squad and platoon level assignments, training enlisted personnel to assume jobs as squad leaders in combat. Based loosely on the officer candidate school, NCOC was a new concept where high-performing trainees attending basic infantry combat training were nominated to attend a two-phased course of focused instruction on jungle warfare, and included a hands-on portion of intense training, promotion to sergeant, and then a 12-week assignment leading trainees going through advanced training. Regular Army soldiers who had received their promotion through traditional methods used derisive terms for these draftees who were promoted quicker, such as instant NCOs, shake and bake and whip and chills. The program proved to be so successful that as the war began to wind down they elected to institutionalize training non-commissioned officers and created the NCO education system, which was based around the NCO candidate course. NCO candidate course generally ended in May 1971. Related abbreviations, NCOA, Non-Commissioned Officers Association, NCOA, Non-Commissioned Officers Academy, NCOER, Non-Commissioned Officer Evaluation Report, NCOIC, Non-Commissioned Officer in Charge, NCA, Non-Commissioned Air Crew, SNCO, Senior Non-Commissioned Officer, see also, Comparative Military Ranks, Military Ranks, Non-Commissioned Officers Creed, References, Non-Commissioned Officer A Euro Definition of Non-Commissioned Officer by Macmillan Dictionary. MacmillanDictionary.com. Retrieved July 10, 2012 A, NCO A Euro Definition from Longman English Dictionary Online. Odosiomline.com. Retrieved July 10, 2012 A, Definition of Non-Commissioned A Euro Oxford Dictionaries. Oxford Dictionaries. Retrieved July 10, 2012 Chambers Free English Dictionary. Chambersharap.co.uk. Retrieved July 10, 2012 General Sir Mike Jackson. Cream Paper 46, The Role of the Non-Commissioned Officer in the British Army. UK Defence Forum. Retrieved August 19, 2010 Chapman, 
Jordan. Building the NCO Backbone www.army.mil. Retrieved August 19, 2010 a, Volume 1 A Euro Administration, Chapter 1 Introduction and Definitions. Queen's Regulations and Orders for the Canadian Forces. Assistant Deputy Minister, Department of National Defence Canadian Forces. October 9, 2008. PA 6. Retrieved August 19, 2010 a, Department of National Defence Canada Non-Commissioned Officer Rank Insignia 1967 a Euro 1985. Canadian Military Police Virtual Museum. Retrieved on, December 7, 2011. New Zealand Defence Act 1990-028, Sec 2. New Zealand Legislation, reprint as at July 7, 2010. Accessed August 19, 2010. HTTP, use military about com Air Force Bla Frank 3 HTM, Zays, Melvin. A Euro OE the new NCO, a Euro Army 18, 72 76. Isra Chudrai, the non commissioned officer course, A. B. Dan Elder, Shake and Bake, the true story of the non commissioned officer candidate course, PGS 7, 14 a Euro 15 PDF, Bud Russell. A Brief History of the Non-Commissioned Officer Candidate Course, Jerry Horton, Shake and Bake NCOs, External Links, The Center for Advanced Studies of the U.S. Army Non-Commissioned Officer, A Short History of the NCO, History of Non-Commissioned Officers, Educating Non-Commissioned Officers, The History, The United States Army Non-Commissioned Officers Guide Field Manual FM 7-22.7